Howdy partner, it's Scovo here and I'm here to give you some Scovo skills. Some things that people don't really seem to be picking up on the game. Most of you out there playing the new Call of Duty are going to be doing exactly what I'm talking about and you don't even realize it. You have no idea how bad it's actually hurting your game. Jumping in Modern Warfare 2 is making you hit respawn a lot more than you really should be. And here's why. When I jump an ADS, it is about three times slower than when I'm just standing in IADS. I'll put the two clips side by side so you can see the speed difference and compare the two together. The one that stops first being the one that got sight picture first. Standing wins every time. But that minor detail gets even worse when we get over into other weapon categories like shotguns. So what I'm talking about is right in front of your freaking faces. All right, you see this reticle, the circle reticle in front of my shotgun? Every time you jump, that reticle spreads but your pellet spread seems to be way higher than what that reticle spread actually is. So let me give you an example. I'm gonna shoot one shot at 10 meters and another shot at 10 meters just to the right of it, except one shot I'm gonna be jumping and the other shot I'm gonna be standing stationary, boots on the ground. And I'm not gonna aim down sights and I'll show you the difference because it is quite staggering. So first shot, boom, jumping, second shot, Boom, standing, boots on the ground. Let me show you just how crazy this is. So on the left, we have the first shot we took, and on the right, we have the second shot that we took. The left is the one where we jumped, the right is the one where boots on the ground. But all you smart sons of bitches out there with your fancy college degrees probably already figured this out. But for the first time, I believe, ever in Call of Duty, aiming down sights doesn't alleviate this issue, even if you aim down sights, the pellet spread will be tighter on the one where your boots are on the ground versus jumping and in the air. Now this difference may be very minor, but there is a difference and differences matter when it comes to a game like Call of Duty where milliseconds count. On the left here, you can see jumping while ADS versus standing while ADS. And that is a minor difference, but it's a difference. So even though it may seem meta, keep your boots on the ground, it's better in the long run. You'll hit more pellets. You'll land more shots. That KD will go up. That's all I got for you. See you later. Bye.